Living outside of our bodies has been in the realm of science fiction for a quite long time. But with our present level of technical advancements, can we experience the outside world without actually being out there? This is the story of a seven-year-old boy who experiences being in a classroom without actually being physically present. Take a look. Joshua is seven years old. Like all other children, he wants to be at school. But he's too ill to even step out of his home. He has a severe lung disease and therefore has to wear a tube in his neck. But Joshua's school has managed to get him an avatar robot, part of a larger research program. The avatar robot who sits in the classroom on behalf of Joshua allows him to interact with the teachers and students. He can see what is happening in the class and can also ask questions to the teacher when he needs to. Weil der Joshua eine Trachealkanüle hat, der Joshua mit einem Jahr ähm, musste der Joshua operiert werden und da haben die zu uns gesagt, entweder legen wir den Joshua für drei Monate ins Tiefkoma oder für mindestens zwei Jahre einen Luftröhrenschnitt und da haben wir gesagt, als seine Familie, da machen wir das mit dem Luftröhrenschnitt, ne? weil wenn der Joshua wieder aus dem Koma wach geworden wäre, dann wäre das alles nicht mehr so schön gewesen wie jetzt. Ne? Warum? Warum? Na, weil, weil dein Kopf ganz lange geschlafen hätte. Und wenn dein Kopf wieder wach geworden wäre, dann wäre der Joshua noch kranker gewesen als jetzt. Joshua's health is expected to get better. In a few years' time, he may no longer need this robot and can be physically present in the classroom. But this new technology that is still in its nascent stage is expected to help others like Joshua to experience the outside world when they themselves can't physically step outside. Bureau report, we on World is One. Okay. We on World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.